Like, uh, so what I normally uh, ask the guests are like, what kind of porn do you watch? That kind of stuff. Um, well, I, I'm, I, I guess I'm freaky or whatever, like a freaky person. I, I have a wide variety. Like I have a, a, what do you call it? Experience palette or a palette. I have a, a wide Eclectic variety taste. palette. Yes. Like of different <laughs> things that I like. Um, I like role playing a lot. Uh, my favorite role playing is, is vampire, like pretending I'm a vampire. Oh, and please pause and, and tell me more about this because I've asked people about role playing because I know it's out there. I'm like, someone's out there being schoolgirl and teacher or, you know, I don't know what the scenarios are, but like, okay, so vampire. So how does this go down? Is your, are you a vampire? What is your partner? Uh, he's a vampire too, you know, uh, sometimes he's not a vampire. Sometimes, sometimes I turn him into a vampire. You know what I mean? Uh, we, uh, we'll pretend like wine is blood and like pour it on each other's bodies and, and, uh, you know, sip on it, like on our, on our bodies and, you know what I mean? Yeah. So is there like, like an elaborate story fighting. that you guys um, like come up with? Girl, yeah, I'm an author. Of course. <laughs> My imagination is crazy. Um, I mean, it's, I mean, it's not like a, it, it wouldn't be interesting if we like did it all the time. I feel like, you know what I mean? It's yeah. Just like, so it's a once in a you know, while thing. Well, not, not a once in a while thing, but it's not like every day, you know, that okay. would get tiring, but yeah, but it's it's often enough, you know, like we, we do it or whatever. We do the, the role playing. So. Okay. Well, I just think that's awesome. And, you know, just it's, it's, I feel like a lot of people struggle with the ability to communicate their, their fantasies to their partner. Right. So like, you know, right. how did you get the courage to say, Hey babe, I want to be a vampire. <laughs> like, can you, can you just pretend like I'm turning you into a vampire? Cause you know, like I know a lot of people, have these fantasies, whether it's role playing or bondage or something else, but, um, you know, it could be nerve wracking to bring it up to your partner because what if they laugh at you or what if they're not into it and then they look at you weird or something? What, what advice would you give to people who want to, you know, um, you know, broaden their horizons when it comes to these different kinks, but are a little nervous about bringing it up to their partner? Uh, my advice would be, you know, um, bring it up to them casually and, you know, um, you just just bring it up to them casually, but talk to them about it. I mean, if you don't ask, the oh, the answer is always no, right? So uh, ask, you know. And and if they're not willing to do that, then you know there's always compromise. You know, relationships are about compromise. So I'm sure you could get what you want and they want at the yeah. same time. You know especially, what I mean? Especially if you're um, in love with someone, right? I mean, maybe if you're like just started exactly. dating someone, you might want to hold off on asking for vampire role play, <laughs> right? Um, yeah. 